This is Sneaker Gears, my name is Levi, and I want to bring you a new series just named Quality. So a lot of the shoes nowadays, especially Jordan brand, and really a lot of other companies starting to really up their prices, where Don C is just released at $650, yeah, the Pinnacle is at $400, and we're not talking about packs and multiple shoes, we're talking about one pair. And again, in hindsight, this is still gym shoes. So we're not talking about Italian boots and handmade dress shoes where you know you can spend a couple thousand. We're still talking about shoes that are casually worn that technically you could go to the court with, but obviously wouldn't recommend on these retros. So really on the quality, what we wanted to do is bring you a standard, a base. If you're gonna spend your money, your shoe should be better or equal to this. And just taking a look at, it's the infrared pack. So we did an unboxing on these. Really just wanted to bring you, you have suede completely, all suede up on the black, and an all leather up around the infrared. And what I like about this is it's the infrared pack, and it's actually red. So it, it's a little bit different than the Varsity Red, but it's not pink. So I'm gonna pick these up. I know I wanna get a good camera shot of these. They are just perfectly executed. I mean, these are in beautiful condition still. But just going through the leather, if we can get some hits on there, you still got a soft upper. I know I had the Cement Forest from, what was it, 2012? And the upper on that, Jordan was trying to make sure everything was uniform. It just felt like plastic. I mean, if you kind of get into it, you can still see nice cuts of leather. This is not so, you know, some skimpy, cheap, fake leather that they're using nowadays in a lot of the shoes. Just overall, the feel of the tongue, the materials on the entire upper. It's just leather, but you have multiple layers. It feels soft. You put it on and molds your foot very easily. And it's just something where this should be a standard. And honestly, for the sixes, I don't think we got there until the recent maroons that came out. So we'll, we'll touch on those later. The suede is what really kills me because this thing is just fire. I just, you can't feel it, <laughs> but these are actually very similar to like your Don Seats, where you just have an incredibly nice suede covering the entire shoe. And again, this is what Jordan won his championship in, right? So if his preference for the final games, where he's putting it all on the line, this is what he wore. This shoe, this material, it breaks in a little bit softer and nicer than the leather. Super soft, just goes with the oils of your hand. So, so I mean, yeah, so this is just an exquisitely perfectly done shoe. If Jordan does any more suede shoes, and they haven't done too many, this is where it needs to be at. This is the standard of quality that we really want to touch on. So I really wanted to bring this pack, and what's crazy is, what did this pack initially sell for? 350. Are you kidding me? So the Maroons are going for what, 220? So you got two pairs of shoes back in the day. So Jordan, if you're gonna be charging that much, please look at where you came from, look at what you used to bring out and give us the same quality. And this goes for all the brands. I know Yeezy, Adidas, you know, you guys are starting to up the price on a lot of their stuff. Uh, Reebok's coming hard with the Kendrick Lamar collab, just making sure if you're gonna charge premium prices, bring us the materials. I think a lot of sneakerheads, a lot of uh, uh, people enjoy and appreciate the level of quality and craftsmanship put into a shoe where you feel like it's worth your money. So hopefully you guys enjoyed this pack. We're gonna bring you, this is again the first part of a quality series. We have a couple things in store where you guys can see what you should be getting, what you're paying for. Again, this is Sneaker Gears. My name is Levi. Please like, subscribe, hit us up, let us know what you'd like to see, and we'll talk to you later.